The following presentation is protected by both copyright and patent pending laws of the United States. An aging collection of a limited number of refineries have created the phenomena in oil production known as stranded oil and gas. The term describes oil, once found, left underground for want of transport. Distant oil fields must await the slow expansion of the pipeline infrastructure to reduce their cost of transportation, forcing drillers to sit on tapped reserves, their investments unrewarded at times for years. Obviously, the answer to this marketplace conundrum is to decentralize the refining process. The solution, decentralization, on-site refining. In our view, the producer in the field needs a way to break free of the bureaucratic, archaic, and ever-costly infrastructure that dictates prices to him. We believe he needs to be able to process his own crude right in the field. This is done in small modular phases. In such a mini-processing unit, the crude oil is first cleaned in a prep stage cycle, then separated into the various base products ready for further refining. However, since the useful life of an oil field is finite, even this prep stage must not only be small and modular, it must also be mobile so that it can be relocated to another oil field in the future. Specific process equipment suitable for the prep stage is designed and fabricated on skids. The skids are mounted onto special flatbed trailers that transport them into the field. A series of trailers, each equipped with different modules, are gathered at the job site where the skids are offloaded and bolted down in predetermined areas on a concrete foundation. Once in position, they are interconnected to form a complete functional processing unit. The entire system is sized to accommodate the quantity of crude produced by the field. When job sites are located in a flood zone area, all skids are designed to operate while still mounted on their trailers. There is no need to shut down the refining process. In addition, optional decking can be included to provide a safe working platform for operating personnel. As the addition of other oil wells increase the volume of crude, the processing unit is increased incrementally with an additional plug-in module. In this way, the processing unit can grow, but only when it needs to. There's no need to build a large complex to start with. The first stage. This stage is commonly called a topping unit. In addition, U.S. mini units are far more efficient, modernized, and clean, while the large and much older plants are polluters. It all begins with our modular segmented pipe distillation column. Its advantages are numerous. The segmented column is mounted on a special trailer designed to carry the entire weight of the tower, including all internals. Then, once in position, a special trailer mechanism will self-erect the entire column. Customization is an efficient virtue of the system. Once bolted to its foundation, on its proper orientation, the distillation tower is complete, ready to be piped up to the other equipment and therefore ready for operation within a few days to a week. As mentioned, each cylindrical section is a stackable module and the number of modules is determined by the quantity of crude initially available for processing and by the various product reams selected by a client to produce. This approach allows the oil producer to better plan when to drill more wells because, as more oil becomes available, you simply add an additional module to the top of the column, rearrange some minimum piping, and you have quickly increased capacity. Each module section is dedicated to a specific process stream so that the production results are the same as with the usual one-piece tower. In addition, the internals for each module are identical and interchangeable should the need ever arise. Also, when it comes time for maintenance, the modules are simply unbolted, lowered onto a special maintenance trailer, where the internals of each module can be lifted out like a cartridge, ready for cleaning or replacement with new cartridges that can be shipped to the field in advance. This is made possible by the fact that the internal cartridges that go into any module section are identical. 
With this built-in flexibility, both foreign and domestic producers can benefit by developing their own refining capacity quickly and economically. The second stage. As the field grows, certain producers may decide to expand even further with the addition of a stage two mini refinery. Small modular and mobile units mounted on special trailers are sent to a designated area, set up, interconnected, and begin refining the various process streams generated by the initial prep stage units. Here, once again, as the refinery needs to grow, a simple plug-in module or two is all that's needed. The third stage. Certain producers may wish to go even further after the refining stage. There are literally thousands of final products that can be produced in a wide variety of specialty units. Here once again the exact same philosophy continues. Our system provides the opportunity to set up a regional network. Stage 1 prep units can be deployed over various fields and supply a single Stage 2 mini-refinery, which in turn could supply third stage finishing units. We realize there is a lot to consider, but we believe the decentralization philosophy, utilizing the mini-mobile, build-it-as-you-need-it approach, offers the maximum economic benefit for the producer in the field. Summation while the segmented pipe distillation column is the main innovation of the system, all other equipment is skid-mounted and positioned onto flatbed trailers for delivery to the field as specialized packages. All skids are offloaded and positioned in designated areas of a concrete slab. However, when job sites are located in high flood zones, all skids are designed to operate while they remain mounted on their elevated trailers, and optional decking can be provided to connect all trailers. The number of trailers needed is dictated by the initial quantity and quality of the crude oil to be processed. Additional trailers can be added as plug-in modules if needed in future expansions. The client has some additional choices, for example, he can elect to provide his own storage tanks for both crude and product inventories or load refined product directly to waiting tankers and simply have the end user send a driver in a semi-tractor to retrieve a load on a regular schedule. He can decide on how many spare parts he wants to keep on hand or order them as needed. Spare gaskets, burners, insulation, wiring, etc. We feel the mini-modular mobile build-it-as-you-need-it approach offers the maximum freedom and flexibility to the field producer and should increase revenues significantly. Ameridian Process Systems brings innovation to an industry that needs to expand in new directions. Contact us to discuss the possibilities. The preceding presentation is protected by both copyright and patent pending laws of the United States.